Hey guys, I'm Bill Ratzik. Welcome to the show. I'm Lisa Givens. Thank you for joining us. And we begin with a story about the fastest growing segment of the booming medical marijuana industry, smoke-free cannabis infused food items. Yeah, that's right, Lisa. These products deliver the benefits of medical marijuana without even striking a match from cannabis olive oil and soda pop to pretzels and ice cream. We have an exclusive look at the pros and cons of these new edible medicines. They're referred to as medibles, food items or edibles that contain medical marijuana. They're consumed by patients to treat chronic pain and other medical conditions. And as you can see, they aren't just typical brownies anymore. For Cheryl Schumann, a cancer patient in California where medical marijuana is legal, medibles have become a part of her daily diet. The great thing about cannabis is anything that you can make with olive oils, truffle oil, coconut oil, or butter, you can make with cannabis. Penne pasta, chicken piccata, great lasagnas. Can you taste the cannabis? No, no, they're delicious. And that's what's so deceptive because <laughs> with edibles, while it tastes delicious, it is in fact medicated and you have to be careful not to eat too much. It can take 20 to 30 minutes before people start to feel any effects from it. It lasts much longer when you eat it than when you smoke it or vaporize it. So that's the one reason why people would prefer that because they're getting longer lasting relief. Do you get the same sort of feeling when you eat it as opposed to vaporizing it? People tell me that they get a little bit more sedated uh, when they eat it over a period of time. So a lot of them are careful about eating it early in the morning and throughout their day, although they do appreciate the pain relief that they get with it. Dr. Bressler also cautions parents with young children about storing their medibles at home. I think people have to put it in some kind of protective container. We don't want to leave prescription medications lying around where kids can have access to them. Dr. Bressler's warning is especially important since most medibles sold at dispensaries are snack items such as cookies and candies. This is a medicine and you need to use it sparingly as a medicine. Are there directions? Directions are on the label. Serving size, quarter of a brownie, and then do not exceed a quarter of a brownie. You have a new patient or customer that right. comes in. They've never tried a medible before. What do you say right off the bat? Every edible is going to work differently. Like the lemonades are going to affect you very quickly. Whereas the chocolate bars or my brownie or cookie will take longer to metabolize. Tell me about the candies. The candies are made with a concentrated oil and they're 60% in the dominant, so that means they're more physically relaxing without completely putting you out. How about this one, the Peace Crispy Treat? Peace Crispy Treat, probably one of our more popular starter products. It's an easy, compact way to go. It's very cheap, it's about $5 per unit. Tell me about the pretzels. Everything I make is made with concentrated cannabis, so they're stronger than anything else out in the market. What's the most favorite of everybody who comes in here? The chocolate bars are fantastic. These would tie with my lose a day brownie. Because when you eat, eat too much of it, you lose an entire okay. day. That makes <laughs> <laughs> While medibles have become more sophisticated and certainly more tasty, remember, there are precautions to consider. I'm Asha Blake, America Now. Asha, are there any food products for patients who may have food sensitivities or any dietary restrictions? As a matter of fact, there are. At least three of the products that we saw were gluten-free, and another product was geared towards vegans. And Sam says even more products are on the way. Hmm. I appreciate it. Good advice.